Hello everybody, I'm finally filming another random ramble video vlog thing. Um, so I filmed one on Thursday and today is Tuesday and I don't really have too much to say and this is kind of the reason that I haven't filmed any videos at the moment, or not videos, I've filmed videos but not any vlogs, is because there's not really that much going on. So and anything that is going on is kind of just boring general things. Um, so I didn't really want to film them but I just thought I'd do a little bit of an update here because I have a couple of things to say. First of all though, just to get it out of the way, obviously last time I filmed the vlog video I said I was going to the dentist and I went to the dentist and I was having a tooth out but so it was all fine like if anyone else is having a tooth out or needs to go to the dentist I was a bit worried about it went into the dentist and they started doing anything and honestly it wasn't really it wasn't a big deal at all the main problem I probably was the worry like just moments before was worse than what they actually did and they were messing around for ages and then I thought they'd done it and I was like oh okay phew you know that was nothing kind of thing and then they're like oh um I'm really sorry we can't we can't do it we haven't been able to do it and I was obviously that's like the worst thing you want to hear I was like what I haven't been able to do it and it, it was weird and I was like oh no and they're like okay yes yeah, so we're gonna have to put you in for um a different appointment because we need to do a more they need to do a different procedure I don't really know how to explain it um and it's this, it's this kind of longer appointment and this whole other big thing uh, but they were like oh it won't feel any worse than what happened today and I was like okay but then the worst part was I have to wait three weeks, well it was three weeks the other day, so three weeks to have, I've, I've now got half of my tooth out and half of it, that you know the underneath bit is still there um, so obviously they were like, you know, you have to be really careful because it's a risk for infection and you just have to be careful with it, blah blah so now I can't, so for the week before I had my tooth out I had to be really careful while I was eating because it actually, ow, hit myself in the face it was actually moving around so I was trying to eat like soup and pasta and just those kind of stuff and now, and I was so excited to have my tooth out to be able to eat cereal and ribs and I don't even know anything. And I was going to have a smash cake for my birthday, which is this weekend, and I was so excited. And then they said that, and I was like, oh no, I can't have anything to eat still for three weeks. So I was sad about the food. That's what I was sad about, and plus I couldn't have a coffee for like three days, so it was, that was probably the worst bit. So yeah, dentist stuff has been going on and then I've got the dentist again at the end of May so I'm just hungry now all the time uh, I can have yogurts as well, there's actually quite a few things I can have, it's not that bad I feel like I just uh, listed full of all these foods that I wanted and I was like yes and then it was like no so but anyway um, so that's that, an update on that next thing I know a couple of you guys have actually commented, which is really nice, thank you, um, that my eyes are looking a lot better and they are, they're almost, touch wood, 100% better. I mean, they're kind of a little bit uh, different colour just because of, I don't know. Um, but obviously as well, I haven't got any makeup on, so and uh, a lot of times, you know, without her makeup on, your eyes are always a little bit different. I think maybe mine were beforehand, I can't remember. Um, but yes, I'm really, really, really happy about that. But one thing is, I haven't stayed at Josh's house since the, since kind of towards the end of January. Obviously now it's May, and the reason is because um, in January, on the 27th of January, I woke up in the morning and my eye was swollen, one of them. Um, and that's when it all began, and I stayed at Josh's house, obviously I stayed at his house many times before this happened. So... I was obviously worried and then I never, I didn't stay at his house again and obviously it continued to happen and it got worse and it was other things, it was nothing to do with, anything to do with his house but because the first time it happened I stayed there, I was kind of like ooh and I wanted to be really careful and just everything like that so I think, I'm pretty sure I'm going to go stay at his house tonight I'm still going to take my pillow because I've got like a special pillow um, but yeah, I'm really nervous, darling, it's really stupid, but it was just because that first time, and I'm really worried that, you know, but I, I know it's not anything to do with that, so I don't know why I'd be worried. But also, I need to, um, my Blu-ray player went a bit weird, like it stopped working, or some discs wouldn't play, which, if you watch a lot of Blu-rays, you know that's always a terrible sign. Um, and Josh had gotten a newer Blu-ray player, but we didn't use it very much, so... He brought his new Blu-ray player here, which is really, really good. It enhances the pictures as well, which looks awesome. 
um, and it has Wi-Fi as well, which is great. Um, but also, then the, my Blu-ray player that was here, we needed to take to his, and he just hadn't done it yet. But I wanted to watch A Monster Calls tonight, and maybe Passengers. So I need to, well, I'll show you in a second. So Josh sorted the Blu-ray player out and put it on the landing. And I was like, oh, okay, yeah, it's fine, I'll bring the Blu-ray player. And I was like, you know, where did you put all the leads? And he was like, oh no, I didn't, I didn't sort the leads out because it was just a big tangle mess. And I was like, oh. And they literally are, it's like this whole, everybody knows if you've got like leads of things, it's just jumbled up with the PlayStation, the TV box, the TV, and the newer Blu-ray player, the old Blu-ray player is all mixed in. So I need to kind of unravel it all, plug it back in, check that that is the Blu-ray player lead, and of course find the remote, which again, I feel like if you watch a lot of movies you'll know, I don't know if anyone else has this problem, I'm always losing the remote, <laughs> always, like, oh my god, where's the remote, where have I put it, I don't know why, I always think I try and put it in the same place, but I still lose it every now and then, uh, but yeah, so now I've got to find a different remote for the old Blu-ray player, so yes, yeah, so I'm on a Blu-ray player mission today, and yeah, I just thought I would make a little video about it, because I feel like I haven't been vlogging anything, because nothing exciting has been happening, because there's just been a lot of doctor's appointments, dentist's appointments, other doctor's appointments and just kind of this boring stuff so yes okay so i just started this whole thing about how i was going to say josh's for the first time in ages well i switched her on the phone and he was like oh yeah no i thought that actually it was best not to just in case because with my birthday being this weekend he said it'd be just our luck that then my eyes would get bad and then it wouldn't we wouldn't be able to show what we were doing the weekend and i wouldn't have as good a birthday so i'm not going to do that now but at least I shared a story with you. I feel like that's what these vlogs are at the moment. I feel like they're not pointful because nothing that I'm doing is, feel like nothing's exciting enough. I don't know if anyone else would feel like, knows what I mean if they were to video, I don't know. But I have to say sometimes I do enjoy watching other people's vlogs when it's a bit more of the mundane stuff because I'm like, oh yeah, I can relate. But this isn't even that. This is me just chattering on. Anyway, so hopefully the next clip you'll see, which I don't know when that'll be, maybe it'll be at the weekend, maybe it'll be my birthday, or maybe something exciting will happen first, will be a little bit more thrilling. One thing I will say though, this video, um, which I'm going to upload in a minute on, what day are we on, what day are we on? Tuesday. This, I really think this is a really cool video idea, it'll be called the quarterly roundup. Um, Josh came up with this idea, and it took me about two hours to edit this video, which doesn't usually happen with videos, there was so much going on but i think you guys really enjoy it so i hope that you do even though you will have seen this by now that you see this but if you haven't seen this video i will link it and definitely check this one out because i really put a lot of time into the editing so hopefully you guys will think it's awesome too and this is what the thumbnail looks like in case i don't know you were looking for the movie and that's what it is 2017 movies quarterly roundup and it's pretty awesome but it's pretty long it's like 20 minutes so definitely grab some snacks i mean most of my videos are quite long that's just because i like watching long videos and making long videos so hopefully you do too okay guys so it is the next day after filming that bit yesterday and i thought today i knew i was like right i know what i'm gonna film for a bit of the vlog because i know if i don't film anything for days and days and days it just ends up like last time but I last week started tidying up my loft area, which is still not tidy. By starting tidying up, like half of it I tried to organise and it's still not brilliant. You'll be when you see it, you'll be like, this is tidying up well. And then there's half of it which I haven't done yet. So I need to do that. But I thought I'd show it midway because yeah, and plus it's, it's a movie room basically, so I thought it'd be of interest to you guys to see it and just kind of have a little look around and a mini tour, but I will warn you, it is a mess. I only cleaned, tidied half of it, but it was way more of a mess before, so I feel more like, yes, you can see it now, that it's not completely a mess. Um, but I do find it really hard to keep it organised, I don't know, I think it's just because I generally can't fit everything, and that's definitely why I'm doing unhauls as well, I made a whole video about that. Uh, but yeah, so I just want to take you guys up to the loft and let you have a look around. Okay, so this is the kind of us going up. I actually don't remember now how I left it. Okay, so you can see, yeah, okay, it looks, okay, it actually looks more messy than I thought because somebody's been trying to get a suitcase out from what I can figure. This stuff wasn't like this. Okay, 
Hold on, let me just rearrange a tiny bit. Hold on. Okay, so I don't know how to get those things back together. My mom went to Germany yesterday, so she might have been looking for a suitcase. But either way, this area isn't an area that I worked on, clearly, the bed. But this area was a little bit different. Things just change all the time. So these were there. That was me. I put those there because I don't know where they're going. These are board games. Woohoo! Board games. These are like dimensions that just have a home there. This, you know, oh, that's bedding. This is a, okay, so we went to Hobbycraft the other day and Josh picked up all of these paints. Uh, obviously there's paintbrushes. These are paintbrushes actually that I got for Christmas. These little tiny ones, look how tiny these are. Hold on. Josh picked up from Hobbycraft. There you can see this pretty tiny. Um, and then he also got, I don't know how tidy he's left it, but, oh yeah, it's okay, um, these, so he's got, um, the metallics, which are really, really nice, these were only about £1.50, we're going back to Hobbycraft really soon, so I'll make sure to take you guys with us, and then he got all of these, and each one of these was only 75p, and they've worked really well, um, because we've been painting, I'll show you in a minute, we've been painting some figures and they get there and that goes there but it just wasn't so that's a paint box, Ooh, paint box at the moment so and as you can see I once got this box for my birthday when I was 18 yes 19 I don't know so that's that okay this here um this is what I was talking about I, I don't know why the top's like this <laughs> really like I say it was tidying you should have seen it before so this, hang on, let me try and find a way to show you. This is one that Josh painted, and I can't zoom in because I've got still cream egg problem. Okay, there we go. No, okay, it's not gonna work. I need, I broke my camera with a cream egg. There we go. You can kind of see. So yeah, he's been painting these. So that's that. I've also got in here things like like a dimensions, there's an amiibo there, um, some Pokemon cards there. So that's what that is. That's pretty good. I like that. Okay, now over here we have now this is the bit, believe it or not, this is the bit that I sorted out. I know it doesn't look like it, but before the stuff that was on the floor came up to the edge you just walked up and there was just stuff there so obviously at the moment here isn't anything too bad i've just got some there's a futon a tripod some bo boxes i can put stuff in that these are toolboxes and little tools that i need to maybe just shuffle along and then we've got dvd shelves and some cds disney infinity figures on top of there some books that I'm in the middle of reading or actually have read or going to read soon and then these are actually empty boxes and there's a picture there that I need to move I'll put that out for a reason and then we've got this fan which oh it's actually very useful but yeah um we have book shelves and then on that shelf there is mostly all the Percy Jackson books that I've got just put this I was actually moving stuff around um random things I don't know what this is see I can get rid of this what is that I don't know charger um this is another DVD shelf and it's got some space because if you saw Josh filmed a video um okay so I was here and the camera died and I can't remember what I was saying but basically some gaps because I'll show you that in a minute there's another box of films and then there's that okay now this looks like a mess you're like what such a mess but it, it, it's not as bad when you kind of break it down I did actually go through every single thing I mean that's a scarf which you know why keep a scarf over here I don't know this is a beanbag let me move this Okay, so move the beanbag. Oh, this picture actually, I needed this. Okay, so this is a picture of me 
and my dog and I'm going to take that to my dad's house on Friday so I needed to find that so that's fine okay now here still looks a bit messy to be fair I've got some books which are supposed to be certain categories another bookshelf there but then there's like one two three four boxes of movies there well obviously this top one isn't movies it's um Skylanders and Disney Infinity and such and then we've got some board games there um and then there's another box of movies there which is movies so as you can see movies are pretty that's basically all of that is box of movies obviously there's a record player another box of yeah, playstation 2 games movies then we've got more movies trinkety bits and then this other beanbag chair so again if i move the beanbag chair i sorted out all these books and it's on the floor but still so i try to organize all this and sort movies out but there's just so many boxes of movies and then again i've got this here which is pretty deep it goes back one two three four um four piles of movies this is obviously the table where we'll film some videos this is what i've got left of any easter eggs um these are all the films that i was talking about a minute ago that we did in a video obviously that's the chair this here hold on let me just ah try and squidge past here is that obviously is josh's guitar and all of this stuff all of this random stuff is all to do with guitar so yeah you can sort that out that's why this is the side of the room that i didn't even touch and then again we've got movies so people keep saying oh my god you're getting rid of so many movies but there's just so many movies that it you know all the little figures that have obviously all fell down my pocket box juggling balls movies there all those ones there are the studio ghibli ones and then we've got gossip girl and you know there's just a bunch of things which a lot of these movies i really like i mean i'm looking through this pile I'm like yeah i love those um but then again some of them i still need to sort out and then obviously there's a tv there this part is a disaster that's my next part and then obviously this side So hopefully that was cool to kind of just see. I know it was a mess. I felt like I'd achieved so you should have seen it before, I should have done before and after, but I still need to continue on with this. So once I've got it spot on, then I can show you it and you'll be like, ah yeah, I see. Things have improved. Um but yeah, so you can see there's just too many movies everywhere. And again, this is in the loft, which is, I guess, a movie room. But then in my room, I have shelves of movies, um, a wardrobe type thing of movies, chest of movies. Like, again, it's just more movies downstairs, there's movies. So I really do need to D, you know, with the movies. So I feel like it's all just, but I just thought I'd do like a little tiny tour of the loft area because maybe you haven't seen it before maybe i've done one of these before i seem to keep making videos that i've already made uh, i made a video the other day called top most watched movies or something and i found out i had made that video about two years ago or three years ago and i was like oh i don't remember making that video but okay um but yeah so that's that's this um i do need to sort out a lot of things like i say i still need to sort out bed that used to be a nice comfy place to sit obviously at the moment it is it is not um and i just need to get things organized because i feel like i didn't mind used to what am i saying i used to not mind being not as organized and lately i find it really like ugh, i just want everything to just get a bit more organized um basically and if you can see if you're a really organized person this room whew, this video probably just drove you nuts you're gonna be like oh my gosh why is it like this well it, things get out of hand but i actually uploaded a picture on instagram probably a year ago or a year and a half ago and this room looked awesome it looked really nice and cozy and comfy and it was spotless and awesome and yeah so every year i try and really just sort it all out and then by the time a year comes round it looks a mess again i don't know 
Um, but yeah, I think this is the end of this video because I feel like it's getting a bit long because we have this and then the other bit. And then at the weekend, I know I'm doing some awesome fun stuff. Hopefully, I have some fun stuff planned. So I want that to be its whole own video, hopefully. Um, but yeah, until then, guys, I will see you next time. Thumbs up if you enjoy these vlogs. I hope you liked seeing a little bit of um, the loft here and just kind of some movie room and how I store my movies. Um, but yeah, until then, I will see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching this video. I will see you then. Bye!